Cubs are looking to put this series in the books. Uh, top one, Kyle Hendricks uh -oh. on the hill. Ambush. Uh-oh, hold on a second. Uh -oh. The Cubs, Goodness. that would be their fourth leadoff home run allowed. That's the most in baseball. But uh, it, it's only worth one, Cliff. That's it. That's all. Still got to score to win, right? That's right. I don't remember a team scoring uh, with zero runs, uh, winning a ball game at least. Uh, bottom third, uh, let's go. Runners on, the Giants up a three spot. And Dansby Swanson says, you know what? It's time uh, for me to flip this switch. Grabbing a little outfield grass. And sometimes, Cliff, it's all you need, man. All you Great base running by Nico in that situation, too. That ball could have easily been caught, but he went halfway, made the read, and was able to score. Yeah, he was listening to uh, Rick Ross. Yeah, all about that hustle. A couple batters later, down a dash. Jan Gomes, gas oh. money. Uh, two RBI double. Cubs back in front. It's now 4-3. to three, And, well, like you said, this game was a little back and forth. There were some strange plays, but uh, Jock Peterson, someone get him a Tom Mansky video immediately. I ain't going there, man. Like I said, running score position tonight, Cubs did a great job. Six for 13, Yon Gomes making himself some money this year. The year is happening. Oh, oh there pull he those is. hands in nicely, did he, Jock? Yeah, Sean Marshall used to call him the Jockta right there. RBI double, Wilmer Flores. Yeah, he gallops to the house. Giants, uh, they square things up for each. And then Hayden Wisniewski, yeah, he would get the pill. J.D. Davis. See the ball, hit the ball. It's a simple philosophy. The only problem is that he's uh, on the wrong team, Cliff. Yeah. yeah, he got all of that one, didn't he? He did. Yep, just enough. Uh, but getting all of it is the same thing. Giants are back up a two yeah. spot. People all of a sudden, oh, it just made it out. Oh, that's enough. You ever taken BP at Wrigley Field with the wind blowing? <laughs> uh, try again. A seventh inning. Let's go. Say a Suzuki uh, with one thing and one thing in mind. Let's get this mm. ball game back to zeros. Just the way he stayed back on that baseball lets you know that he's in that comfort zone that, you know what, he should be all smiles. Did, did he hit that one under Irving Park Road? Might have. He may, he may have, but we're going to get a little feedback on that just a little bit later. A few sticks down the road. Nick Madrigal, fielder's choice, a little Baltimore chop, and, uh, and that's a tough play when you're taking it's that angle from play. third. You know what, though? Look at this. Look what he's running at. Inside the baseline makes it a tough throw. Coming in at third base, but you did say what we was watching over the top. He, he came you over and, and didn't try to flip it sidearm, and then Dang. that was a problem. That led to this dude, who is a problem. Dynamite in that bat, and that bat flip. Well, it's a thing of legend. The boys love him over there in the dugout, Don't right? They? It took him about five minutes to get around, but he could, he could take five to six minutes. That's all right. He's watching some Daniel Lobo back film, and uh, that's <laughs> nothing wrong with that.